So here we have, are with Rafa and Kyla. Um, Rafa is doing really good. He's um, 17 years old in June 1st, so I'm getting ready for his party. But it's incredible just how fast he eats and how much he enjoys food. He's like a little puppy. And I remember he was actually born in my house in South America. He flew over to the United States um, when he was uh, three months old. Then I applied for a um, work visa, which got denied. So um, immigration sent me a letter saying that I need to, um, that I should leave the country within six months. So I left. Um, so both of them went to South America um, with me. They were with me for almost a year, like nine months over there. Kyla, 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 you ready? She's, um, Kaila. So, Kaila was very different before she would eat. She would barely eat, but then basically what I started doing is I started uh, mixing their food with uh, wet food. Um, so I, I want to kind of show the food that they really like. Um, it really made a big change in his appetite. Um, so this is what I give them. Basically, I prepare the food every day. Um, so it's blue homestead homestyle recipe. So this makes the food basically. And I bought the senior edition. Um, Kayla is also a senior. Uh, she's gonna be basically 14 years old, so she's not young. Uh, so let's say they're both senior, even though one is like super senior. Um, so they're both extraordinarily happy with their food. Um, Kyla just wants to eat and jump and just eat everything. And Kayla, before that wet food, she would barely eat. She would take half an hour to eat her food. And sometimes she would eat her food in like 24 hours. She would just bite here and there. That how she's, um, she's never been fat. But now that she has wet food, uh, look at that face. Um, Kayla, do you like wet food? You already ate everything you should. Um, so now Kayla is under, a, is attacking Rafa. Uh, Rafa cannot defend himself anymore. Um, Ra Kayla has always respected Rafa. And she would never dare eat Rafa food, Rafa's food. But, you know, when she realized that Rafa is super old, I guess... The roles reverse so now i protect rafa every time uh, they don't fight they've never been in a fight only one time kayla do you remember that time you got into a fight with rafa you just like you you just stood up and you're like, rrr, rrr. do you remember that time and rafa felt so sad i think that's when he realized he's not you know alpha chihuahua anymore do you remember kayla that fight fight that you guys had um, it wasn't even a fight, it was like a show of power. And since that day, um, I think that was like 2018 or something. Um, so since that day, I think there, Kayla started realizing that she has a little bit more power now. Um, so now we're here with Rafa. Uh, you could buy this um, really nice sweaters in Amazon. Um, I've tried many many sweaters. This is the one that I like the most It actually keeps him really warm during the winter, but you can also he can also be in the Sun with this thing And he won't start sweating or anything um, All you have to do is open up like the zipper over here and then if you open the zipper it, It'll still keep him uh, away from all the dirt plus he can still enjoy outside they really go uh, they really enjoy going out in the sun um, both of them are really active for their age um, but Rafa is impressing me like it <laughs> I don't think I remember him enjoying the food so much maybe he was super hungry today um, we've had a couple rough a few days um, he had a pee accident and so I'm 
cleaning everything in my room um so that's gonna you know I, I went to another room so i need a lot of um cleaning like deep cleaning um so I, i've been really cleaning everything from the room because i i still want rafa to sleep uh with me like next to me so basically what i did was i bought some like um super um crazy like absorbent like towels that uh, plumbers use so i want to put that on top of the mattress uh, because disinfecting a mattress like three days of work and <laughs> i just still i don't want rafa to sleep by himself he i know in his eyes when he's gonna be sad um so rafa likes to basically sleep with both of us and that's how it, it's always been um if I leave Rafa in the floor, basically what he will do is he will start walking like at, you know, 6 a.m. So that, that's not good for, for me. Like, I really like my sleep. Um, but So basically now what Rafa is doing is like he knows the food is basically over. He's just trying to see if he can eat a little more. Or no, I think the, I think he still wants to eat a little more over there. Um, so with age, uh, Rafa developed arthritis. Um, so he can walk a lot, but he's always been like that. He basically eats like um, if he would if he would be in a five star restaurant. And, um, he's always been like that. Um, so that's what has kept Rafa alive. Basically, his appetite for food. He truly enjoys like the senior wet food. And I just started giving them that food maybe four years ago. So I would say his first 13 years, he just ate normal food. Um, I do admit, I just used to buy him whatever cheap food I could find in Walmart, which I regret now. Uh, but now when I find uh, good quality food, I feel like it makes a really good difference. Like they're happier and then basically it helps them now to support him, Rafa, in his and he joins I buy special food that's for adults um, so this is the food that I buy um, I basically went to a place where they recommended me this food um, and this is especially good for seniors um, so th this food is like cold heels and then it has a salmon and a bunch of stuff and it's also spe specifically designed for small and mini dogs so basically with this food plus the wet food, that's how we can have this amazing result. So what Rafa is gonna start doing right now is like he's going to, what I like doing is after he finishes eating, I know at some point Rafa um, is gonna pass away eventually. That's just the order of life. Um, but what I what I do is I try to help him eat, um, so he gets a little exasperated because um, his plate moves a lot. So, baby, let, let me help you. So what I do is I just put like the food in my hand, and it's the sweetest feeling you can have. He starts like licking you, and um, I I like giving him food basically almost like I'm his I like feeling his tongue I'm just eating from my hand Rafa Rafa so I like, I like I like when he eats from me my hands Rafa come here there we go you like it and because uh, a few of his teeth were taken out because of his age, um, he cannot chew like super hard food. But we, when the food is wet, it really helps him. And I really, <laughs> I really enjoy like feeling his tongue and giving him food directly from my hand. Rafa, come, come here. Here. So that's when we noticed like he's a little blind right now. Um, I'm not even sure if his sense of smell 
works really well but after he noticed there's food he really enjoys basically what he wants to do is he wants to eat every single one of these guys and so I stay with him like an extra 10 minutes and um, Kyla is already like Kyla already realized that you know she had enough food and um, Rafa is the one that likes to stay here until there's absolutely no more food on the whole earth so basically I just tried to put my hand right in his mouth and um, she starts biting me it's funny so we're gonna try to finish all the food Rafa I have like eight more and that's when <laughs> This is super nice because you it almost reminds me when he was like three months old and I was teaching him how to do everything. So he is basically like a, a big baby right now. Okay, so he realized there's food there. There's like four more. Rafa, Rafa. And then after that, basically what he wants is a, a little bit of water. And then he'll, he'll have a very good night to, tonight. Rafa, one more. Rafa, Rafa. Oh, and I forgot to say, Rafa is bilingual. Speaks Spanish, English. <laughs> Come on. Rafa, tell me. Alright guys, so thank you for watching and please comment, like and subscribe. Bye Rafa, bye. We're done baby. Baby, you like the food? Oh, there's one more. Wait. Yeah, one more Rafa. Come on. Come on baby. Rafa, come on. Come on, the last one. You can do it. You did it. And there you go. Thank you guys for watching. And Kyla, the problem is like you eat so fast. Like you need to enjoy food a little more, okay? <laughs>